In fact, the Prophet, peace be upon him, reminds us that three people on the Day of Judgment will be questioned and with which hellfire will be ignited. He said, a scholar, a donator of wealth, and a person who fought in the path of Allah. The scholar will be asked, for what? how did you use your knowledge? And the scholar will say, Ya Rabb, I used it for your sake, and I taught it for your sake. And Allah will say, you are lying. And the angels will repeat, you are lying. You only taught it so that people can call you a knowledgeable man or a knowledgeable woman. Then the one who donated will ask, be asked the same thing. Allah will say, I gave you wealth. What did you use it for? And he or she will say, I used it for your sake, my Lord. I donated for your sake. I used it in your path. And he will say, you are lying. And the angels will repeat, you are lying. You only donated and used your wealth so that people can praise you. What a generous man he or she, he is. What a generous woman she is. And the third person who fought in the cause of Allah. What did you use your health and your body for? And he will say, Ya Rabb, I donated it and I sacrificed it for your path. And Allah will say, you are lying. And the angels will say, you are lying. You only did so, so that you can be called a brave hero and monuments to be built out of you. And so Allah will say for each one of these three, you have received what you worked for. You received the reward that you did it for. Today you have nothing. And that is where Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in the Quran, Man will not receive except that which they worked for. Your intention, your goal, your purpose of why you did what you did. And then Allah says, and their work is looked at in particular. Allah says, I'm looking at everything. And then they will receive exactly as they worked for.